rush, rush that down. And then you have Cole. And whenever you try to explain how Cole plays, you kind of can't. So people's uh, explanation for Cole was voodoo magic. And that's really kind of how Cole plays. And Guilty, also a very good Dalsum player. But will she be able to stop uh, Voodoo Magic? Well, <laughs> I would hope so, because as long as she gets Lockdown on it. Um, yeah. I know that as far as she's part of the Sim Clump, along yeah. with Cole. Cole yeah. is very adamant about Sim. Yes. So him, uh, Arturo, Champ, Guilty, and I think a few other people. Commander are, Jesse? Yeah, Commander Jesse. Um, they definitely are trying to pioneer the, the meta for that and see exactly how far they can take that character. I'm surprised we don't see other Sims coming out of the way. Like, I'm pretty sure, I know Lucky D, a uh, good Dalsim player, East oh, Coast. He's very, nice. I, I saw him at PAX East. He played very crisp. Uh, who else do we have that is Dalsim players? I would like to see, uh, was it Y? No, it's. What was his name? YTP? Y2J? I don't know. Is it STJ? STJ? Was he a Dalsim player? Uh, STJ is a Falcon player from Falcon. Melee. UTJ. 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 Uh, he was an old Dalsim player. I would like to see him come out. There was a Canada Dalsim player named uh, Mar. I don't know if he still exists. I'd like to see the old, the old, the old Dalsims come out of the word board because the character is very good. I think the only argument that he's not top five is he has some bad matchups, but he's oh, yeah. so good. He can beat any of the top five if he like the Shoto top five. He can fight them all. Uh, but here we have the first round, and this is gonna be a lot of feeling each other out. Uh, Domdai is gonna stick to an older style of I'm gonna throw the best poke in the game at you, which is fireball. And you're gonna have to find a way around it. And it looks like Za is doing just that, but anti-aired out of the corner. Has that fundamental ST background and low jab, but gets hit with a V skill. Yeah, hits a stand short into V trigger. Yeah. <laughs> That's only negative two. I don't see the point of V reversaling there. Vega is negative two on that, so do not V reversal when it's your turn. Especially against Vega, who does not have a reversal. What does he have that fights at negative two? Nothing. Dandai closing it out. Still able to maintain core position. Still able to maintain meter position. Thing I think we'll see about Dandai is when he, it's his turn to meaty, it's his turn to hit someone when they're knocked down, I don't think we're going to see people wake up jab or wake up stand short. Because Dandai is known as a monster when it comes to the lab. This man figures oh, yeah. things out. In a game where things weren't supposed to be figured out. And this is a game where things are supposed to be figured out. So I think we're going to see him be very crisp on his set play. But as you're seeing a lot of these, he's just not as familiar with certain situations. But that is so uh, that's You got commentator cursed on that because Damdai, uh, I think, is going to be very ready. He's a lab man. monster. This man, this man, he knows he has to pay the cost to be the boss. Man, that, yeah, that, that shut me up for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, he's that's a lab monster, that. man. Yeah, that, and that parry, that's... It's only problem is it has startup. Yeah, but I do like that. It's not like Third Strike where sometimes you can guess parry. There's a commitment behind it. But once you have that hard read, why not... But unlike parry? Third Strike, you don't have to guess between low and high parry. Mm -hmm. Like, so it, it needs some kind of repercussion for that situation. Damdai, uh, it looked like they were feeling each other in round one, but Damdai clearly showing that he's ready in Street Fighter V. I Definitely. think this is his first real showing. Has he been at any other majors? Uh, I, I saw him at NEC. Okay. Um, I don't know if he's been traveling out anywhere else, but uh, pretty solid. Round Didn't make one. it out of pools. I believe we both got beat by the same Bison player. Who's in my pool. Well, he looks like a maybe a new man in this game. He might have put put in the work. He might have uh, paid the cost. He's definitely put in the work. Uh, currently a platinum level or one of the top reus online. Okay. So he's been grinding. Uh, and what a lot of online, a lot, uh, online allows you to do is get used to players in general what they want to do in a lot of situations. It gets you, it gets your situational awareness more instinct, more in your bones. But uh, online again, you're gonna have to deal with latency. You're gonna have to deal with the inability to properly whip punish. You have to play a little bit of a different game. But it allows you to learn people, and I think that's really important. I think Damdai is gonna use that to his advantage. He went. I think he got countered out of the the. Uh, Maybe Parry. Parry startup? Yeah, yeah Parry that's Startup, I think, is a habit. It's it's a good move, but... Man, three frames? Uh, three frame Startup. Alex yeah. has a two frame Parry Startup, though, yeah. for this legend. But Alex just holds this. Like, it's just yeah. always a parry until it's, a, it's a, yeah, an he's attack. Yeah, he's a pretty cool guy. Yeah. 
I don't think people are using him to his potential yet. I think he's way better than people think. But uh, here right now, we see again a slobber knocker of a round where both players are getting in there. Damzai taking a commanding lead. He has also the resources to make a sweep safe, so he can kind of throw buttons out there right now. Balls the overhead. A, an overhead attempt. Oh, ah, no parry. No parry again. He, we know he can do it. Uh, you know, I, I do respect the fact that he tried it a few extra times. He was just yeah. like, you know, I got blown up real hard for it, but I'm not going to stop. So we know he can do it, though. So we know that he knows. But it's a question of executing. And this game seems to be a lot of that in the first few months of its inception. It seems a lot of people know what they want to do, but when it comes time to do it, there's a lot of choke city population players. Like, it's pretty rough. Putting yourself in the corner is horrible. I don't get why people do that. Congrats, you're in the corner. Congrats, you're in the corner. Especially <laughs> like, with Vega, it's a position you never want to be in. But. No, because your V reversal doesn't give you anything in that position. But, I mean, Damn Die turning it into uh, a round for himself. And just hucking, hucking plasma. Just, Losing uh, the mask would take all that damage. Damn Die trying to close it out. but Very maybe upset court. about how that last round ended. <laughs> like Not hitting those parries. Yeah. Everyone. People are kind of gathering around. They want to see Ryu at that top level hitting mad, mad parries. Yeah. I mean, parry is probably one of the hyper things we can get in this game is when you see a clutch parry. Uh, the non-gray life, the ability where it doesn't matter how much life you have, you can always parry is really cool. I always love that setup for that spin into command grab. Which I don't think is real. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's not real, but you yeah. have to... It's, it's one of the layers. Yeah. Because you can interrupt the, the follow-up he does, which is the claw, with any uppercut. Yeah. And if he does the cancel, I think it's safe where it's oh, upgrade doesn't hit. That's another thing that I really respect with Vega. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. So using but. it to potentially get a little more meter to maybe close out the round in a second, but he has Dengen on deck as well. Vega has a V trigger, which will blow up any fireball in reaction if he so chooses to throw a fireball. Damn die throwing straight. Oh, my God. Oh, no, it's this over. It. Oh, wow, he didn't do a combo. He could have done stand roundhouse, stand jab, low strong, EX wall dive, uh, hits in the air into V-Trigger. Oh, oh, wow. wow! He's got that new new, and it's over! That was a great re That yeah, neutral dive. jump medium kick in this game, Street Fighter V, all of your jumps are the same, so since medium kick is Ryu's cross-up in neutral jump, it's also a cross-up.